Sutra. There was the light cloud of great fulfillment, the light cloud of great compassion, the light cloud of great wisdom, the light cloud of great prana, the light cloud of great samadhi, the light cloud of great auspiciousness, the light cloud of great blessings, the light cloud of great merit, the light cloud of great refuge, and the light cloud of great praise. After emitting indescribably many light clouds, commentary. As said, there was the billions and billions of clouds of great light. Since billions and billions are numerous, he will only name ten. These ten represent the contemplation of the ten vehicles and the ten drama realms. As said, the light cloud of great fulfillment. Shakyamuni Buddha released lead clouds of great perfection, which are symbolic of how the realm of Buddhas pervades the entire Dharma realm. Perfection means that something is non-existent, yet omnipresent, shining on all places without an exception of a dust mood. All of space and the Dharma realm are covered by these great clouds of light. This is the realm of Buddhas, which is perfect. The light cloud of great compassion. Kindness can bestow happiness, while compassion can uproot suffering. This is the Bodhisattva path. Bodhisattvas conduct themselves to bring living beings every happiness and uproot living beings every suffering. Whatever living beings enjoy, give that to them. They like sweets, give them sweets. They like sour things, give them sour things. When Universal Worthy Bodhisattva was the temple's dining hall attendant, someone who stands by the table serving and refilling food for monastics, he had all the seasonings with him on bottle after another. You enjoy something sweet, and he will add some sugar. You enjoy something sour, and he will add some vinegar. You enjoy something spicy, and he will give you some hot pepper. He had bottles all over his body. He carried all these seasonings with him because if someone wants something sour, he will pour something sour to him. But the person will complain. Hey, I do not want that much. How come you gave me so much? Someone says uh, he wants something spicy, but the Bodhisattva is afraid to pour too much, so the person will not want it. He pours a very little, and the other person yells, Hey, some more, so little. Universal worthy Bodhisattva has a hard time satisfying living beings. He gives a lot and they complain that it is too much. He gives a little and they complain that it is too little. See, it's not very easy to be a Bodhisattva.